nuclear fission is really, really dangerous and really difficult to control, man. I mean, we play basically we play with fire. Even this, even even more dangerous than fire, right? So, uh, the way that we con uh, they control uh, nuclear fission in the reactor is really they just like uh, con uh, control system after control system after control system. Everything have to be in hand and to be controlled, right? So, and look at right here. Um, on the left side, start with on the left side. This rod right here, this is a few rod where we keep uh, uranium-235, uranium-238 is in here. When the fission happen, the neutron move quickly uh, from one rod to another and hit another uranium, hit another uranium, it's just go, go from there, right? So uh, these neutrons are high in energy. So right here, they are really high in energy. So like they're running real quick. So try to like hit another urani uranium to keep sustain um, the, the nuclear fission. So, and this is the problem why we can't control it because they're too, like the, the, these neutrons are too high in energy. So, when the, when the fast neutron coming out of the first, uh, the first generation of the fission reaction, uh, we run water through it. it. It could be water, it could be graphite, something inert that can, uh, uh, slow down this fast neutron to just, uh, in a walking pace so we can control it. Okay. So the, uh, the, uh, the, so we can control the fission reaction basically, right? So that's what we call a nuclear moderator. They usually uh, have uh, heavy water or graphite. And all right, control system after control system. Not only the moderator, we also have a control a controlling rods, all right? So the controlling rod. So right here, this is the fuel where we keep um, the uh, uranium two thirty five and two thirty eight. Okay, the controlling rod is right here at the top. All right, the controlling rod can go up and down. When it go down, so when it go down, so this is the fuel is down here. So this is a fuel down here. This is fuel. When the controlling rod goes down, it stops the reaction. The controlling rod usually uh, is made from um, an element that are able, are able to absorb neutron and or slow down the fission rate at a at a safe level. Usually made of boron, cadmium, hafnium, or some other stuff. All right, so uh, when control rod come down no reaction because it's absorbed all the neutron when it goes up the reaction happened the neutron just start moving around again that's how we control it okay all right next one so uh when the nuclear reaction the fission go uh, uh in in the process is keep going the whole system get hotter so we have to cool it down talk about reactor coolant really important 